What to wear, Yorley? Welcome to Norfolk Island. It's the best side on earth. It's a beautiful side for Rachel's little sullen. We all love ya, we love it, we look out for one another. So, welcome to Norfolk. Prior to the NDIA, there were no disability services on uh, Norfolk Island, so our aim was to establish some services so that all of the participants who came into the scheme have opportunity for choice and control in purchasing the services, what they want and where they want that. We worked with community, we did a lot of consultation and we met with families and we asked them about the things that they love about being on an island and some of the things that were challenges for them. Understanding what those challenges were, we set about trying to establish services that were going to address those challenges. My role is a new role which was created when the NDIS came to the island. I currently support 14 participants with varying disabilities and they are ranging from preschool to late 30s. The NDIS has been fantastic for the island and they have um, allowed the participants to get more independent and also providing support for the families which they haven't had before. My name is Leighton, I'm 20 years old and I live on beautiful Norfolk Island. I've been on the NES a year and it's a lot of fun. It helped me, help me do my emails, do help me to understand about bills, socialising, a bit of everything. Since the NDIS has come to Norfolk, for Jeremiah he's had a lot more opportunities, he's getting more social time. We're getting access to speech pathology and behavioural therapy and we've done some keyword signing and he's really coming in leaps and bounds with that which is fantastic. I am 30, I am 70. I like dark big Next, I'm thinking the mum. We always sort of kept our mind open as to what what were the possibilities for John T when we got back to Norfolk. His special school that he was attending in Brisbane, they used to cook biscuits for dogs. How many of these do we need to pop in? Five. Oh, perfect. I guess the the big uh, beneficiary of the whole exercise is John T because he gets out in the community, he's delivering his biscuits. It's been really successful. We know that John T, as far as going into the future, is going to be looked after. Um, with our involvement in NDIS as the overlay, so it's just fantastic. The families are growing so strong here on Norfolk Island and they are succeeding and they are talking to us about the next step and the next step. The successes are going to be their own. I just look forward to being able to look back and seeing my little part of that journey. We all look after each other. Everyone else who's got access to NDIS will be seeing wonderful improvements as well. It made me really confident to walk around town. I like to visit to my friends and different places on the island. I am very happy. 